Long time no see. So while we have a chance in between rain showers, I wanted to do a quick garden update. Now, we're still relatively new to Wisconsin, but our fire season is springtime and it has rained almost every day all spring. So nice that I don't have to water the garden, but we have really long winters and I'd like to be outside a little more. So let's go check out the garden. Here's the beans and cucumbers. Doesn't that look beautiful? It's just this sea of green. Ignore the noise in the background. The neighbor's clear cutting his lot. So, cucumbers looking good. Getting bigger. Look at those. Look at the leaves on those cucumbers. Boom, huge. Watermelon is slowly making its way up. It does have some new leaves, but we'll see how it does. Lettuce wall seems to be doing okay, I guess. Not too shabby. We'll see if uh, we get anything significant, but we'll see. The kids garden doing, doing okay. They're still tending to it. Now here's the corn. Now this is what's very exciting. Look at this. Look at how beautiful and green and vibrant they look. And let me show you. They're nice and steady. So their roots are getting deeper. We've got lots and lots of squash coming up. But what I've noticed is the stalks they're kind of flat and I don't know if that's because of the variety because when you look at the cornfields their stalks are very very round so if anyone has any knowledge on that it would be very welcomed advice but otherwise they're beautiful and and, and very nice potatoes as you can see, they're still trying to put flowers out, at least this box is, but they are so chewed up. I mean, I just, it breaks my heart to look at these things. I mean, look at these over here. Look at this. Nasty little things. Just, ugh. So, I'm just kind of doing my best to keep them to keep them alive we'll see how it goes the peppers now the peppers seem to have loved loved the rain because they are just exploding they have like doubled in size and we do have blooms and that's the question is even though we've got these blooms it's been raining every single day so I don't know if there's been any pollinators out here Here's our slicing tomatoes. These guys look gorgeous, especially this one. Look at that, just what a beast. So they look very, very healthy. I've been trying to keep the leaves up off the ground. Um, but like I said, it's been raining so much, I don't always get a chance to get out here as much as I'd like. Aromas look absolutely gorgeous. Okay, now here's something that I've been doing. These are all Roma tomatoes. Every tomato plant in this bed is a Roma. And I've been pinching leaves off that are on the bottom or trying to pinch suckers off. And because they've seemed so little, I've been pinching their flowers off. See, like this? I think these will be flowers. Um... Now, I read a few articles today that said, do not do that to your determinant varieties. I don't know for sure whether or not these are indeterminate, determinate, or semi-determinate. So, I hope I haven't ruined my tomato production by pinching this stuff off. But, we'll see. I mean, they're still putting out new leaves. I've got flowers coming in on these guys. 
So I'm hoping I didn't completely ruin it. So again, if anyone knows anything about Romas, and if they'll be okay, <laughs> it would make me feel better.